welcome back guys so this is act 9 and i'm gonna finish up act 10 also let's just complete all of them all right Right, let's go, let's go. Um, okay, so first up is the blood aqueducts. Um, I have people asking me about here. Question: um, Should I stay here and farm for the tabula rasa card? The answer is no. Okay, why? Because I'm proceeding to quickly get the uh, what's that the the, the kiosk recipe is much faster than you farming the tabula rasa card so there you go you have the answer getting as fast as possible to get the kiosk recipe which is here the blood acula onwards from now onwards right um save all your rare items okay all of them i literally mean like every single one of them um whether is it a uh, trash weapon or whatever keep all of them do not review them and start farming for your chaos recipe so what i will do from now onwards right every yellow yeah there you go every yellow or rare minion uh, monster that i see i am going to kill it okay because that's going to start my chaos recipe they are more likely to drop rare unidentified items okay so yes, it might take a bit longer to clear the X, but it's the same when you go to uh, your maps, correct? You are going to start farming for all of these items also. So it is kind of like the same time period or time frame where you actually start farming for it. Okay, there is no right or wrong. Kiosk recipe is um, just two weapons. Uh, basically one set of weapons. It can be like a bow and um, what is that? a bow and a quiver or it can even be two ooh, or it can even be two wands just as long as it's a set of weapon okay be mindful of that uh divine flask i am going to use this i will need level 60. okay so once you reach Agni, right keep every single one of the rare unidentified item okay do not identify it at this point of time it is very useless to identify and try and get good stuff already i would rather just um save all of the items and do the kiosk op recipe all right your kiosk op recipe is going to bring you all the way until your low budget is complete okay once you complete your low budget then you do not need to do anything all right Right, so once you are in that. town, uh, you don't need to I talk to anybody, okay? So just, um, if you need to check for items, please do check them. Good luck. You must be I think it was Irasha. Yeah, Irasha is the one that sells the items. Okay, so, whoa, we have a six socket again. I'm going to get it. Um, any more other interesting stuff? I actually have red already, so I need the helmet. Uh okay, don't have. Am I? And then we sell stuff. Uh, no need, no need. Okay, so this is where I actually say like it is important. All right, I'm just gonna put this in front. If you have a court stash, then it's really good. Okay, so what I will do is I will just put all of the make sure it's eye level sixty and above. All right, then. Put all of the um, unidentified rare items into a big stash tab. Okay, um, <clears throat> for now I will just leave it that way first because I don't have any good items yet. And then go up um, to the top right of the town and that's where you actually start at night. Okay, let's go, let's go. You don't need to talk to you. You don't need to talk to any NPC, okay? Okay, let's go. This is where it starts to get a little bit painful, okay? Um, and this is where actually determination comes in really, really well. You won't get randomly one shot from uh, physical hits from all the white mobs or any other mobs. Okay, let's wait. I went to the wrong one. Yeah, at this point, right, I won't ignore, like I mentioned, I won't ignore any of the rare mobs already. 
I'll just kill every one of them. Oh wait, this is... Okay, sorry, my bad. Over here, right, the next area is actually at the bottom right. Okay, yeah, there you go. On the right side. Not exactly bottom right. Okay, so I will just keep sliding myself like to the right side. Ow, oh, that hurts, man. Who is hitting me? Oh, the mages are hitting me, no wonder. Take the boots. Do not identify them. Oh, it's that. The Arch Nemesis um, effect. Okay, this is the really, really painful one. You have to be careful, alright. Alright, so just keep moving upwards for here. Uh, move, move, alright, and then go down. And this area will be on the right side again. So just keep going towards the right side. Okay, cross the bridge. Ah, uh, excuse me. Oh, we got a hand. Nice. At some point, right, at some point from here onwards, you will start to um, get extra items. Oh, there's already maps. So if you see maps, just keep them first. Right, they are really good for later on when you get stuck. Ow! I... Hello? Holy shit, I froze there like forever. That was insane. <laughs> I froze there for like freaking long. Right, this is where I die, right? Yeah, it's annoying those pesky mages. Okay, let's continue on. Okay, next. Bus. Fastiri Desert, Fastiri Desert, Fastiri Desert, okay, whatever. Over here, I will always keep to the bottom uh, side and just keep going right because there is a side quest here. You will actually need to find um, the quest. So I will always, um, yeah, I'll just always keep it on one side. Oh my god, that was really, really pain. What the heck? And if you actually see uh, Immortal Syndicate, I will recommend you to do it, okay? Yeah, I, I will seriously recommend you to do it because you will unlock additional benchcraft and the benchcraft can be really, really good. Wait, where'd he go? Is he possessed? Okay. So yeah, you see? The bow? Um... This one, you review it. <laughs> this one, review it, okay? Oh, we got the quest. Okay, so the quest is at the bottom. Sometimes the quest can be at the top. So you need to be careful with that. Let me clear up this. All these things first. Okay, and then activate this. And now you have to kill everything that comes in. Right, just kill everything. Kite them if you need to. Okay, and then the last part will be there will be one Goliath um every every corner of it. Okay, we have a shield also, nice. So take the storm blade and keep moving right side. Okay, do not stop moving. Um, do not stop towards the right side. Uh, the portal will always be there. There you go. That's the portal. So take the portal. Um, take the 
crafting recipe and from here onwards right you are going to continue to keep going on the right side because we will activate a um, side quest that is also on the right side again okay but which right side i don't know so once you see you keep turning okay so it's here let me clear this first all right so once you see this breach right they tell you talk to sin about sandstorm open up a portal oops open up a portal go back in and talk to him while you put in all your stuffs okay so talk to him and then you talk to this person uh they'll give you a reward you can try for the wand right so i'm gonna try for the wand see if it's any better uh huh this is better this looks way better man why is level 59 okay i'm gonna keep it first okay i am going to put back the stuff so this is how like i will arrange so i'll arrange like uh boots glove i have the shield so shield is technically under weapon as well okay and then i am going to review Right, all these are very useful okay next time so just just unveil it first because you won't know what you need to do with uh what you need to do with it later right after you unveil you can just sell them um what i don't where's my map tab uh one minute it's here right yeah okay and then go back to the portal, right? The Vastivi Desert. Straight first away, you can go into the Oasis. Okay, so just complete this first. Um, lean towards the right side of the map again. Just keep going the top right. Okay. So you see, I'm just going towards the top and then lean towards the right side. The boss will always be at the top right. Um, exactly which top right I, I also not sure so there's a little bit of trial and error you might go left a little bit there you go you might go to the left side a little bit but yeah this is what I'm talking about it's on the right okay we're done so first phase over then you need to chase this tail like all the way can be a bit annoying because of the sand actually yeah it's because of the sand that it's a bit annoying hmm. but eh, nonetheless it's still fine you will drastically reduce your cast speed okay Some wisdom. I think this is the last one. All right, and then we're gonna fight the boss now. Right, let's go, let's go. Okay. So phase 2 is over, it will go into some vulnerability mode. Um, usually I'll just like stand at one corner and just keep moving left and right. Okay, so once the tail is up, you can start to hit it again. Oh, okay, there you go. It's going to go up and down and dive in and out and then just burst it when it comes out right we're done so you need to take note okay sometimes like the your filter might not show i will keep this also okay so hold alternate and make sure that it's uh or you pick up all the rare items okay go back to high gate store your stuff right sword and then uh my body armor i will put like this okay 
Okay, and this one is to be yes. sold. Uh, not here. So next is this. Uh, let me see if there's any other item to buy. Nope. At the skill point, I am going to go downwards for power charge ready. Okay. We are done. So now go back to the Vastiri Desert. And we are going to go upwards instead now. Alright, so just go upwards. Keep going upwards. Just need a moment. Hey, red. Oh, bow. Oops, I press my flask. Okay, foot heels. So over here, um. Same thing, there is one side quest over here, you actually need to find a... Is that a Minotaur or something? Yeah, this, 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 uh, Avalanche Rider, but much bigger, alright. So you need to find him, and he shouldn't be at the start, so... Okay, so the waypoint is over here. If you found a waypoint, you can go into the next map, which is the Boiling Lake first, and do the side quest finish. Right? There really isn't much uh, thing to worry here. You just need to keep going right side. Right, right side again. Just keep moving right. Just keep moving right. Okay, you eventually... Oh my god, that's a beast. That's a red beast. It's a little bit far, okay? It's a little bit far. Okay, so when you see the bench craft, you know the boss is there. Oh, that hurts, man. Alright, done. Once done, um, you can go back to town. Okay, and then uh, if you want, you can... No, it, actually it doesn't matter. Just go back to the foothills. And this time make your way... Wait, is that a rare? Alright, that's a rare monster. Uh, make your way to the top left while finding for the side quest. Okay. It can be anywhere, okay, honestly. There is no... Um, there is no good explanation of where it is, that's why I am going to weave like left and right like that now. Oh uh, no, that's not the one. Where is it, man? Be careful not to miss it, okay? I have a very strong feeling I kind of like miss it already. Okay, it's here. Yes, okay, yeah, I, I, I forget the name. It's called Boulder Back. <gasps> so, yes, kill him, get the quest item, and let's keep going. This round, uh, just, just keep going top, topwards, alright. You will find the area to the next place. Top left, it is. Okay, tunnel. Hello, tunnel. Okay, over here, just, just keep going. Just kill and keep going. Right, um... Something is burning me. Ouch! That hurts. Right. So... I will just keep moving top side. Again. Right. It's the same thing. 
So it's always the top side and then there will be like a small small way like over here just now where I cross. And that's where you know you are actually on the right track. That's the waypoint over there. Okay. So this means you're on the right track. Just keep moving and then continue going topwards. Ow, that hurts, man. A lot. Oh, did it. Right. Yep, there we go. Next area, the quarry. Okay. When you reach the quarry, um, straight go into the center first. Okay. Straight away, that's the first thing you do. Um, go and pick up the waypoint. Okay, that is the reflect. It's a bit painful. Okay, take the waypoint and then go either left or right side, okay? So for here, the crafting recipe on the left, I'll just take the left first. There is two quest points over here. Wait, where is it? Okay, so this is the side quest. Let's do this first. Can you just kill the boss? I Are you coming? Okay. Okay, this after the first phase of killing him, right? It will start to spawn uh, a lot of minions. Okay. Okay, it has not died yet. Okay, so phase two, yes, phase two is over. The total there's three phases. She will go into an invulnerable state for like a while. And then yeah, it it, it pops back on and it will start hitting you. Where are you going? Oh my god, how many invulnerable states do you want to? I'm trying to kill with my best. Ooh, nice. All right. So whenever you whenever you kill a boss, right, make sure to check the items. Okay, it usually drops a lot of rest. So you see, um, I'm gonna take the tiger sword and the mallet. Okay. So once you are done, right, uh, you can head to the opposite direction again. Okay. There we're gonna take. Uh, we're gonna continue on with the main quest, which is to take a item, a quest item, also from one of the boss before we actually go down. Okay, the refinery. So over here, um, you can go either left or right. Okay, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter where you go. If you go left, then just follow through all of the um monsters and then just keep heading right side basically the boss is on the top right okay there will be a door that will lead you through on the top right and that's where you actually encounter the boss all right so it's not wait i think i missed it e nope i did not miss it oh my god it was a dead end so it was actually going to go downwards Okay, this is troublesome. It seems like there is... Oh, okay, the way was on, on the left side, okay. Since I'm already here, let me just switch it to the right side instead. Oh, try not to touch the lightning. 
gonna make you take a lot of damage. Alright, go through. Be careful, okay, when you are. Okay, so it's here. When you see these two metal doors, that is where you know you're gonna fight the boss, and then just. Burst him. Okay, the lightning is very, very pain, alright. You do not want to mess with the lightning. Oh, look, it's very, very pain. Ah, uh, the movements are a bit retarded. Dead? Alright, he's dead. Once die, uh, go inside and take the powder and we can go back to town. Okay, go back to town. Uh, you can submit the quest item. So uh. submit, take a- oh my god, no space. What? Okay, let me just stash up all this stuff first. So all the four, four. Okay, I don't know how I got that, but let's sell and check what items we get again. Mm, nothing good, I guess. Yeah, nothing good, sadly. Right. Yes. So take the reward, both of them. You have skill points added. Okay, we have enough points already. I'm gonna add in the Conqueror's Potency. Store all your stuffs. Um, you can put this one side as well. Okay, I have enough um, level to wear. I'm gonna change it. Right, so this one is better. Okay. Right. Lessons. Hi Jun. And go back to the quarry. Okay, do not go back into the portal. So just talk to Sin over here and he'll open uh, the belly of the beast. Okay, over here just move very linearly, alright, that there is no, there is nothing over here. Just be careful of the monsters, I, if I remember correctly, there is like bleeding monsters over here. So, um, kill them before they die for you, uh, before they bleed you. Okay, that's the exact. Oh my god. Oh, they are just so tanky, man. Okay, dead end. There is a lot of dead ends over here, okay? I can't really tell you like which is the correct way, so... There's a li little bit of self-judgment over here. Why is he so... Is he hexproof? It was a bit hard to deal with, man. Right, I'm not gonna hit that thing. Let's just continue on. I'm gonna take the right side. We actually have a champion kite shield. Wait, is that the... Nah, uh, that's not the boss we want to fight. Whatever, let's just kill him since we are here. Okay, dead end. So many dead ends, it was on the left instead. Oh, that was random.
Right. Q and go, Q and go. Leave no currency behind. Every single one of the currency is very important. I seriously think I need to make a better assassin build. I'll probably try Spark. And then I will probably like post the POB. I I'll try to finish it. I, I think I am very highly and likely going to start uh uh what's that? Uh assassin again next league. Very highly likely. Cause this league was really quite a fail with the Arch Nemesis it was it was really bad those of you that played in the early stages of the league you will understand how it goes it was really really hard and holy crap this map what is wrong with this map man <laughs> I'm freaking going one big round it's taking too much time please tell me it's here Need a moment to catch my breath. Right, right. Oh, God, I keep making a dead end. Here? All right, it's here. What? This area took them long. Uh, okay, shoot. Oh, whoa, 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 echo is. Okay, I'm not taking, I have too much already, alright, so don't need to take. Oh, I stock. Let's just take it. If you are not a unique collector, right, you can, you still will take the unique and then. Review and sell them. They'll give you a lot of alchemy shards. Alright, Black Call. So we need just kill all three of them and then fight him and we call it a day for Act 9. Okay, what level is this? 60. I'm actually under level, so I'm just gonna hit a little bit. Ah, but it's annoying. Some of them. Some of the monsters are really annoying. Hard to deal with. There's a yellow monster here, I think. Yeah, there's a yellow monster here. Okay. Oh, Sentinel Jacket. Ooh, Va Op. Okay. This is not a really good. Okay, so when he does this, right, just stand behind the rock and wait. Once he's done, you can blink in and start killing him. Okay, same. Stand behind the rock. And just wait for him to scream finish. Alright, once you are done, you can start killing him again. And we're done. Okay, so one down. Go to another two more, which is Chevron's. Um, Chevron's is also pretty easy. Uh, Arcane Buffer? Wait, Arcane Buffer plus, wait, how many rares is there here? Oh my god, that was very painful. Oh, we have a Topaz. Okay, so ring are the hardest to get, alright. If you actually see a Blight 
from Ang Knight onwards, I will recommend you to do it. Okay, Blight because Blight drops a lot of accessories. Okay, Chevron, let's go. Oh, that's painful. I should not have done that. Ah, the tornado is really painful, man. I'm gonna die. Yep, I'm gonna die. Will she die first? Nope. I might die first. Okay. I need more oh my god, I got not enough. Uh, okay, I can change this already, so I'll just throw this. I will review this, see if there's anything good. Uh, nope. It's bad. Uh, I might actually throw this. Yeah, I will throw this. Cause we have too many weapons already. Okay. Go back. Uh, if your inventory is full, you can just go back and store first. Remember, every single rare counts from now onwards. Okay. See, this is how I do it. I'll just put it very nicely. And then I'll have boots, and then I'll have rings, rings and amulet, rings, amulet, belt, I'll all put there. So I'll just divide and stack them nicely. Apparently I do a helmet. Helmet will be here, and then the belt and ambulance will be here. Okay. So that's how I do them. I, I didn't really use the... I know there was a... Um, there is an app that can actually help you, right? But I think it's a bit troublesome, so... And the app somehow isn't working for me. Uh, there, there is a bit of a glitch here and there sometimes. So I got tired of it and this is how I've been doing my chaos recipe every time. It's not really a lot of effort. It's just a lot of organizing. Right? If you can organize it nicely, then you don't really need that. This is Maligaro. Maligaro might be a bit challenging or so. Right here. Let's go, let's go. Let's try and do this under 40 minutes. Can I just face tank him a bit? Yeah, I'm gonna face tank him a bit. Alright, he's going to go into inbound. Wait, he's not in inbound ability mode. Oh no, he is, he is. Okay, that's the real one. Kill him. Uh, okay, I'm not taking. And then talk to Sin, submit and fight the final boss and that's it. Okay, black heart, let's go. Okay, that's a bit annoying. Okay, first phase over is gonna spawn all the scorpions and whatever shit. Oh, my golem is taunting. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, oh my god, no, 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 scorpions are pain, scorpions are pain. 
Be nice. Be nice. Oh my god. I don't know if that why he's dying. He's dying. He's fine. Okay, he's gonna burst me again. You just die. I should get out of there. He is dead, I guess. Yep, dead. Alright, finish. Pick up your rare items and ooh, that's a lot of good stuff. Just pick up whatever you can, alright? Done and then sail to Auraf and that's it for Egg 9. Alright, this is Egg 10, let's go. Um, don't have to talk to anybody, just head straight to the cathedral rooftop. Top left, go in. Okay, go in, go in, go in. Talk to Apex and just kill everything first. Uh, my golem is dead. Okay, and over here, just kill the boss. There's a mini boss over here. Alright. Uh, take whatever you need, talk to Benon, and you don't need to meet him at the docks, alright, just just keep going. Alright, so go, 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 um, nope, I'm not taking that. Oh, we have a quartz flask. Alright, um, here is basically the repeat of Act 5, just that you start from here onwards. So it's just think of it like um, a reverse way. Okay, the reverse way from Act 5. So the waypoint to the next or the next area's um, destination is on the right side. Ow, that hurts. Okay, so just keep going to the right. Uh, preferably the top right of this Whatever, this alley very Alright um. Okay, I should be reaching soon That's a bit far Okay, it's here. Okay, so done. Ravage Square, we are back to Act 5 again. So when you are here, the first thing you're gonna do, right, is head to the bottom left, all right? It is very sequential and very easy to follow. So um, head back to the bottom left first, where you actually first came in Act 5, okay? Oh my god, that's quite thin. Yeah, I'm not going to touch that anymore. Alright. Ah, 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 that hurts. That's very painful. The heck was that? Okay, see? There is a small little... Uh, it's not as big as previously, but yes, there's a small little passage over here. Go in. Alright, go to the control blocks once again and take the waypoint. Okay, take the waypoint. Um, if you have a friend that have completed this act, right, there is actually a shortcut for this. What you gotta do is just ask your friend to go to every single waypoint and you teleport him to him. Like in this map, okay, in Act 10. Wait, let me kill this guy first. Please die. Okay, so yes. Um, in Act 10 only. I don't think it's possible for Act 9. So, in Act 10, uh, get your friend to go to every single waypoint on this map and you teleport to him to take the waypoint. Okay? Once you basically take the waypoint, right, you can have shortcut access to all of this without running the whole entire savage squash sheets and whatever is is i mean if your friend has already completed it then good you you can just steal from him the waypoints it's gonna get things done much faster okay all right no wonder it was a bit pain
Wow. It should be here. There you go. That's the one. Okay. Let's kill this boss. Usually I will just face tank him and kill. Cause he has three phases. Okay, phase one should be over, right? Why is he not flying? Okay, once he fly means phase one is over. Um, just be careful. Do not get caught in his um whatever that thing is. Yeah, you should not die if you have determination, alright. Oh, he teleported again. Okay, die, 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 die. Okay, done. He flew up again. Recharge your flask. Yeah, this boss is really, really easy. The nice thing is he spawns all the zombies for you or the monsters so that you can recharge your flask. Every three times he will start to jump back down and that's where you actually try to kill him again. Okay, I will just stay in one corner and just keep doing this. And we did. And we're done. Okay, so once you are done, right? What I'll do is I'll just go back to town. Okay, uh, put in whatever you want. You can talk to Lani for your rewards. Wow, we have... Okay, I'm gonna take Silver Flask. I, I just want more speed. Oops. Why did I review that? Okay, I don't need this anymore. I'm gonna put this, put this. No, my stash. Right. Put back everything in order. Nice and fine. We still don't have a helmet. Holy crap. Okay. Uh, I'm just gonna put this here. And this here as well. Alright, and we are going to keep moving. So go to the waypoint and go back to control blocks, the one that you came in from. From here, it will be a shortcut to go back out. Right, let me show you. Go back out. And from here onwards, you're going to start on the right side. Alright, do not go back. So just keep going right, you will see this reliquary again. Okay. So over here, right, there is a quest item you need to take. There is nothing that you need to kill. The only problem is it can spawn on any corner. Alright, so just take your chances, go to one of the corner and try your luck. I'm taking mine on the left side first, bottom left. Ah, eternal life flask is that. Hopefully it's there so I don't have to go one big round. Oh no, it's not there. Okay. There's only one quest item unlike uh, in F5 where there's three. There's only one in one corner. Okay, oh there it is. So it's on the top right. Take the teardrop. Same. Go back to town. Okay, put in whatever you need. And then uh I, I do I, I wouldn't talk to her first. Alright, just put back whatever you need. Apparently you don't need to put back anything. Okay. Go to waypoint, go back to the reliquary. Same thing, we want to use the waypoint to exit from the area. Okay, we should have our new power charge now. Right. Okay, so over here, what you want to do next, right, is to go to the top right direction. Everything is done here in the semi square already. There is nothing else here. Okay, there is really nothing else here. So just keep going, top right, top right. Um, be careful, the mobs can be a bit painful over here. Um, wait, did I went the wrong direction? Oh, no, 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 it's quite, yeah. So over here... Oh, no, I went the wrong direction. Okay, my bad. Uh, 
thought it might be the other side. Is it here? I think it's here. Ah, uh, yep, it's here. Okay. Oh, we have a two stone ring. Okay, so go past, go through all of these obstacles. Just keep heading to the top right. Um, Okay, we're done and then in front you will start to see a waypoint right here take the waypoint and go to the ossuary uh go into the bone pits there is nothing you need to kill here but there is a trial ascendant over here okay you need to find it i will keep sticking myself to the right side of the wall so that i do not miss anything okay Alright, right side of the wall. I'm always sticking myself to the right side of the wall. Not killing anything else unnecessarily if I don't need. Uh, there is a hideout here if you want. And if you haven't take If you don't know. Okay, why is that? Oh, my golem is taunting him. <laughs> For a moment I was like, who was this guy hitting? Okay. Uh huh. Okay, so this is apparently the quest area. We have not. We have not found the trial. Take the stuff. Oh, the trial is here. Nice. Alright, so do the trial. This trial is very easy, alright. You just need to run. 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 Right, run. See? Really easy. Then go to the center. Ouch. Click. Get out. And we are done. So once we are done, just portal back. Okay. You can deliver the items now. Right, I will take the heavy belt because we need the strength. And then book. And then I will just use this. Review this. Is it good? Is it bad? It looks bad. It is bad. We need resistance. Okay, and then just sell yes. whatever you need. Is this the, the item guy? Okay, Willem is the one that sells it, right? Okay, so check, check, check. Let's quick check. Uh, two red, one. Ooh. Okay, whatever. It's okay. Wait, actually, I think I might need. Yeah, I might want this. I want a better helmet. This helmet is bad. <laughs> Alright. Okay, I'm gonna change. Uh, give me a while. I'm gonna change this. Determination, Defiance Banner. All of my auras is gonna come to here. Alright, I have one more red. I'm just gonna socket it here. I don't need this anymore. It's a very, very low level item. Um, Armor. I need one with resistance. I'm just gonna throw it here. Oops, sorry. What's this though? Strength. Ah, uh, uh, don't need. Uh. I need resistance. Okay, better than nothing. Okay, and I'm gonna carry on. Okay, once you're done, right? Go back to the very square. And proceed on here. Okay, they'll ask you to find a way to defeat Tava's pawn. What you need to do is just find the uh, chamber. Okay, you need to go to the desiccated chamber. Here is a little bit like a maze. Okay, but you realize it's actually just zigzag. Okay, let me, let me just clear this and then I will show you. Wow, the cold dog is so pain. Holy crap, man. Okay, if you can see, right? Hmm, that is not bad. If you can see I came from here The waypoint So you just go like this Go down And then just weave again And you just do exactly the same It is always the same for this map okay, You need to weave in and out Because the passage is blocked here As you can see So now torch call And then we go to the desecrated chamber 
So it's the exact same thing over here again. Exactly the same. Okay, you just need to find the door to the other side. And we will be done with this place. Okay, I'm gonna try and make it quick. Alright, just keep going downwards, right side, top right. Find the chest or whatever, yeah, here it is. So the, the court area or whatever this is, um, after that you just hit yourself to the bottom left. The burn, oh my god, I nearly died. Burn is so thin. Standoff? What is standoff? Oh, Rustic Stash. Okay. Right. Here we are. Wait, did I just added the... Oh, yeah, I did. Yeah, I added my... Wait, did I add my clarity? It's level 12 though, never mind. I'm gonna add one. Okay, take the waypoint and just, just keep going. Low on mana? Kidding me? Why is this guy so tanky? Right. So yes, over here is the same thing again. Once you see the uh, what's that? The the stairs that goes up, you will know you are in the right track, and that's like the halfway point of this map. Right, is it here? Yup, see? It's the exact same stairs as Act 5, okay? Exactly the same. So once you go up this stairs, just turn and do exactly the same as what you did for Act 5, okay? Holy shit, this guy is painful. Okay, and then you can just make your way downwards uh, to the bottom right afterwards. Just Wait, need a my stuff. Catch my breath. Right, let's go. I want to get some flash charges. Allow me. Right, I'm done. I'm full. Let's go. Okay, over here, just kill him. Oh my god, that hitbox, man. My stone golem. Ouch. Ouch. That hurts a lot. Oh, wow. Okay, you're done. Once you are done, go back to the waypoint and you can go back to town. Okay, and just talk to Benon. Bannon? Bannon? Don't know how, don't whatever it is his name. Okay, and then talk to Lani, you'll get a free falling. Okay, if somehow, I don't think at this point, at this point, you should already have a falling, okay? So it's bad if you don't have, but if you really don't have, then uh, take whatever that is needed. Um, yeah, I don't need them. Why did I even review them? Okay, keeping all my stuffs. Uh, nope, I don't need all these gloves. Talk to Innocence. And then just meet him. It's like two more maps away from completing Act 10. Okay, let's go. So now, go back to Rabbit Square. You will talk to Innocence. And then he'll open this path and then just go in. Alright, the canals. Um, the canals, the next area is always on the top left, but how do we go there? Um, it's really a little bit of an RNG, alright? 
there is no exact way also for me i will just keep heading right it's like there's only one direction either way so you just gotta be more alert see if you cannot um there definitely will be some way to just go across it if you have to cross the bridge then please cross the bridge right and then cross back if you need to just stick to one path and keep going okay just stick to one path and keep going that's the thumb of rule over here once you reach a very big square area like yeah like this you will know that uh you're actually on the right track Alright. Oh, uh, dead end. Okay. Just keep going, just keep going. Okay, I think we are reaching soon. It should be very near already, like we've gone so far already. Now it's just Okay, it's the correct way. So the other just going left or right once you cross the bridge twice. Okay, and then it'll be at the end of this building. There you go. There it is. Okay, feeding throw, last map before boss. Let's finish this. Can we do it by 25 minutes? Let's try, let's try. Yeah, I'm not hitting anything special. Um, I think I'm gonna save my flask once we are like halfway through. Okay. I guess we are halfway through. I'm just gonna use quick silver only. Oh, what's that? Alchemy. Okay, alchemy need to take. Alright, let's do this. Wait, what? Are we there yet? We should be very near though. I've like walked quite far already. Alright, here we are. Take the crafting recipe, talk to Sin and go auto hunger. This is the final stage guys. I, shall strike you down. I will always stand at one corner first when fighting him, okay? Okay, just be careful because when he shoot these kinds of fireball right, um, you have to dodge from one end to another. Yep, first phase is done. Ouch, that hurts. I will try to stand as far as I can, okay, because this stage is quite dangerous. Okay, we're done. Now he's gonna pick up one of them. I don't know if it's Sin or. Okay, it's Sin. Okay, we go the other side. See, if you start up from the other side, you'll just swirl from there. So you just need to keep keep this up, alright? Like, um, from left to right, right to left, left to right, right to left. Right, and if he actually puts that red orb thing right, it is actually very, very dangerous. You have to be careful, okay, because it kind of like uh, obstruct one area of this arena. Oh my god, that's painful. Alright, down. He is going to catch probably Innocence now, I guess. 
This kidnapper. I still will stay here if this happens. Alright, he's gonna put that ball already, so... Yep. Just keep shooting. Oh my god, that's painful. I dive right into his... <laughs> Yeah, this 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 red op thing is really really painful. You need to be careful. Oh my god, this is the full one. All right, this is the full one. I have no idea how to survive this until now. <laughs> uh, that was bad. I should have stayed the other side. Is it done? Is it done? Kill him now. Alright. Now we just need to kill the heart. And we are done after that. I need to curse the heart. Oh my god. That's really painful, man. Okay. We're done. Yeah, we are done. Pick up everything you need. And don't forget, okay, when you are done, uh, you go back to town, you need to talk to Lani again for one more book, okay? Oh yes, and there's something that I did not mention. Before you actually fight Kitaba, you can actually do the um, lab first. Because if you do the lab before you kill Kitaba, then your resistance will not be negative. Okay, so set sail. Once you set sail, there is a benchcraft along the way. Okay, um, take it. And then you have to go in. Alright, go inside. There's no need to walk. There's no reason for you to walk outside anymore. Uh, head straight to Lani. Take the passive point skill book. Let me just walk there first. Hurry up. Alright. Once you're done, do this, and then before you complete everything else, type this slash passives. Okay, it will tell you which skills have you completed. Alright, these are all the passive books from every one of them. Okay, so if you actually see a zero, you know that you actually missed one. Okay, then you have to just press U and go back to all of the X to check if which one you have not done. Okay, so it's slash passives. Right? Okay, so that's it for Act 10. Okay, that comes to the end of this video. So um, if you have any questions, do join the Discord and I will try to answer your questions. And if you like my video, do remember to hit the like and subscribe button. I will see you in the next one. Bye.